Wi-Fi, you love it. You need it. You're probably using it to watch this video right here. That said, there are a lot of sort of subpar Wi-Fi scenarios out there that exist in houses. Wi-Fi is always competing with obstructions and walls. Now up until this point, I've been using off the shelf consumer level networking equipment, okay? But I've had my eye on some of the more enterprise type stuff because I am a Wi-Fi enthusiast. When the company Ubiquity reached out to me, found out that I'm actually moving studio spaces into one that's much bigger, they said, Lou, let us sponsor a video. Let us send you our hot new networking equipment. This is called Amplify HD. And this baby claims to have solid coverage over 20,000 square feet. And I said, you know what, let's do it. You've got the router itself with a touch screen. I mean, they've even got the speed test on the box. They know who they're speaking to. And then you've got these two mesh units. Now these you're gonna place in various locations and these three units will then speak together. Here is a diagram of just what I'm talking about. You can see the router unit is in the center of the house here and those mesh points are on the fringes creating a blanket like a warm blanket on a cold day i'm so hot right now you can still wire into this guy you can set it up i like this part via bluetooth and an ios device or an android device so whoo, whoo! look at that unboxing experience wow Factory fresh, power, USB, number of uh, ethernet connection points. These here are the mesh points. Look at that. Oh, so it's got the, the power built straight into it. That's foolproof. Jack could set this up. Uh, Jack has a hard time tying his shoes. I usually recommend Velcro. Oh my, that's a, wow, that's a magnet. So a cable to go from your modem to the router. There's also a power brick here. So the first thing you're gonna notice when you plug this in is this display lights up. And the next step is to launch the application. It finds the router. So we're now connected, little glowing light along bottom. All right, so now I have the router plugged into the modem and I've got the mesh points distributed as well. So it is time, of course, for the critical testing. Let's let the testing do the talking. You can see the reception of each of the mesh points. Now, there is a built-in performance test as well. You can see here. Now, this is gonna vary based on your location, but that's the whole point of these mesh points. Ooh, 150.2 megabit per second. I saw it peak at there. You can see there it averaged out to 113 by 20 with a 19 millisecond ping. Now, if I go out to speed test here, 120 megabit per second on the down. Now on the old network, again, just a standard high-end router in one spot. And that's it. I mean, look, I don't even need to say anything. I mean, the, resu the results speak for themselves, right? You're paying for a bigger pipe, so you might as well invest in the networking equipment that supports it. This is really something that I wish existed a long time ago. Every so often, a, a company reaches out to me and says, hey, please check out our new thing. And then every so often, there's something you, you really wish had existed when you were a kid. All right, so you gotta check these guys out. That's the bottom line. Better Wi-Fi, the proof is in the pudding. I don't need to say it because you saw it.